Hey guys, welcome back. And in this walkthrough, I'll teach you how to make your own photo slideshow. This is really cool for artists or family. Creating a photo slideshow in iMovie is actually really easy. So let's get started. To access my photos, I want to click on this camera icon right here. Or I can hit Command 2. And that opens up all my photos in iPhoto. So, let's go to look in events, and I'm going to create an art photo show. And that's why I like iMovie, because it can be used for family events or professional events. I've used it many a times to create a demo reel or just to showcase my art. So I have these pictures right here, and one way I can grab them all is highlight them and drag them directly onto my project library. And there we go. And the default time is four seconds, and it adds a Ken Burns effect to my photos, which is nice because it gives it some motion. It kind of gives your paintings a little bit more animated instead of just being still. But if we wanted to change the Ken Burns effect, we just click on this icon right here, and that opens up our Ken Burns effect, and we can manipulate it. So this green box is the start point. This that red box is the end point. So we can stretch that out, and we can hit done, and we can check it out. So with photo slideshows, it's pretty good to add transitions. I think the best one you can do is cross dissolve, because you don't want to get too flashy. You want to focus on your art, or just the pictures themselves. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. That was pretty quick, and I bet you it's probably at the default 0.4 seconds. So let's add, let's make that a second, and hit done. So now let's take a look. So we'll come back here, and we'll add some more transitions, and just pretty much drag them in between these gaps. There we go. And then this is since this is the my last photo, I can do a nice fade to black. Open up my transitions. Actually, open up my titles. And we'll add a title right here. And we'll just go to black. And we can do Okay, so now we have the basics, and like I said, we can, co we can go in and edit if we do want the Ken Burns effect, which is good for some pictures, but like sometimes it's going to crop it. So if we want it to fit, we just double click and then hit fit. There's going to be no animation. So let's hit done, and um, we'll ha go ahead and change this one because sometimes the Ken Burns is pretty cool, but you're going to miss out on some of your um, art. It might work better if you're doing it for a photo slideshow for your family. But since we're going to do it for an art project, let's go ahead and fit most of our... Now for the clouds, I think this one would be pretty cool with the Ken Burns effect because it's going to almost animate it. So we'll start off in the sky and end down low. And let's see this one. Let's look at my MJ bag. Now that one is really kind of small, so let's go ahead and fit. Same thing with this Manny Pacquiao bag. And same thing with this bag here. And this lunch bag. All right, so now that we've done all that, so let's go ahead and hit Command G.
So that was pretty cool. Oh, I didn't even get to the credits, but I just wanted to basically teach you how to create a photo slideshow. Well, since we watched the whole thing, let's go ahead and finish and show you how those credits look. Fade to black. Thank you for watching. I think which is a nice thing to say. And if you like adding music, this is pretty much as simple as clicking and dragging. So let's click on this music icon here. And let's say you wanted to publish this to the web and you wanted to make money off of it. Apple has plenty of music that you can use that's copyright free so you won't get in trouble. Or if you're just doing it for yourself or maybe doing it for a demo reel, you know, just to hand out, you're not planning on making any money, you can go ahead and use music from your iTunes library. So, and if you wanted to add music, all you have to do is pretty much just click and drag that right into your project. And then you'll have music in your project. Well, I hope this helped you create a photo slideshow. This has been Ken from Mahalo.com, and thanks for watching.